soil class 4 science by the end of this lesson you will learn about formation of soil composition of soil types of soil soil profile soil erosion and soil conservation formation of soil big pieces of rocks are broken down by wind and water into smaller pieces till we get a fine powder this process is called weathering wherever the fine powder known as sand mixes with the remains of the dead plants and animals called humus and minerals the soil is formed thus this oil is defined as the top layer of the earth's surface which consists of sand remains of dead plants and animals and minerals with some amount of water and air in it this oil is very important for life on earth plants mostly grow in soil they produce food and give out oxygen which is needed by humans and animals to stay alive this oil is also home to many insects and animals composition of soil this oil is made up of different types of soil particles sand these are the largest soil particles silt these particles are smaller than sand particles but bigger than clay particles clay these are the smallest soil particles other than these soil also contains small stones and pebbles which are also called gravel minerals such as iron calcium and potassium and humus soil also contains some amount of air and water now let us learn about types of soil there are mainly three types of soil depending upon the number of different soil particles present in it these are sandy clayey and loamy soil sandy soil this soil has a greater proportion of sand particles sandy soil feels rough and gritty and is non-sticky when wet it does not hold much water and drains most of it clayey soil this soil has a greater proportion of clay particles clayey soil feels smooth when dry and lumpy and sticky when wet loamy soil this soil has almost the same amount of sand clay and silt loamy soil is the best soil for growing plants it is rich in nutrients and humus and allows water to pass through easily soil profile soil profile refers to the layers of soil in the above picture these layers have been named a b and c a is the top soil it is the uppermost layer of soil and contains fine particles of sand clay humus water and air b is called the subsoil it is the middle layer of soil present below the top soil and contains broken pieces of rocks c is called the bedrock it is the bottom layer of soil and is quite deep inside the earth it has large pieces of rocks soil erosion top soil is very fertile because it is rich in humus strong winds and water wash away the loose top soil the removal of the fertile top soil by the action of wind and water is called soil erosion 
strong winds, heavy rainfall, and cutting down of trees, increase soil erosion. Soil conservation Plants get most of their nutrients from the topsoil. Protection of soil from erosion is known as soil conservation. There are certain steps that we can take to conserve soil. Let us see those steps. More number of trees should be planted to replace the ones that are cut down. Trees and bushes should be planted in open lands. This practice does not allow the winds to blow with full force and take away the topsoil. Flowing water can easily wash away a lot of topsoils. Dams should be built across rivers to prevent floods. Summary The breaking down of rocks over a long period of time forms soil. There are three types of soil, sandy, clayey, and loamy soil. The three layers of soil in a soil profile are topsoil, subsoil and bedrock. Soil erosion is the removal of the fertile topsoil by the action of wind and water. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe my channel and do not forget to hit the bell icon to stay updated. Your comments and suggestions are valuable to us.